can hear me. Wow. Yeah. Perfect. A lot has changed, but we're still the same person. <laughs> Morning guys So we're in the kitchen now So just an update guys, I still live in the same place I love it here um, I love the people that I live with And I'm pretty satisfied Anyway, there's already laundry there So we are gonna use the other machine So let's just put our clothes there while we prepare our breakfast So keep watching guys uh. Where am I? <laughs> So this machine guys is an automatic one and it has a dryer as well. So if you don't feel like hanging your clothes outside then just dry it. <laughs> Alright, so it says it will be washing for an hour. So let's go guys. A few moments later. Good morning guys. So I think this is like my formal intro. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back again to my channel. As you guys can remember, this is where I used to vlog in the morning on my, I would say, first week, second week vlog of me living in England. But this is where I live still because I love it here. So in today's video, we're gonna shoot uh, some of the things that I do because I'm on leave today for the record so yeah a lot has changed but we're still the same person <laughs> anyway I'm gonna have my breakfast so I'd like to start off with preparing my coffee guys and then uh, a sandwich so let's get our plate this is uh, my cupboard my little pantry I would say where I get my bread I don't usually toast my bread. I mean, I'm okay with the typical loaf. And then I'll show you a very unique way of making coffee. <laughs> I don't think it's unique. I think everybody does this one. So I'm using this, um, how do you call this? A capsule, a tablet? I don't know, but this is um, a Costa Americano flavor and uh, this is what I used. So first, so it looks like this guys for the record. I'm going to show you the machine in a little bit. Yeah. So first, I'm going to have um, milk here. So I'm going to get something from the refrigerator. This is my milk, guys. Can you hear me? So I have the milk already. Let's just say like one fourth cup or one fourth of this cup. Then I'm gonna put it in the microwave because it's cold. And I don't wanna drink a cold coffee, guys. So I'll put it there for like 50 seconds. And then while waiting, I'm going to prepare my sandwich. So I'll put this one, guys. Sweet coconut spread. I bought this from a local Asian store. So this is what I'm gonna be putting on the bread as a spread. But first, since it's cold and it has sugar, definitely it's hard. So I need to put it as well in the microwave and then melt it and then spread it all over the bread. So as soon as the milk is um, warm enough, you guys can see this. Yeah, so it's warm enough. Now it's time to put this in the oven, microwave for let's just say 20 seconds. Now we're gonna put this to a coffee machine, and I'm gonna. 
gonna show you that, but let's just wait for the spread. All right, it's done. So it's melting like this. It's melting like a creamy uh, consistency. Do you know those condensed milk with sugar? That's how it looks, guys. Spread it on a generous amount, I would say. If you want it to be sweeter, then you have to put some more. If you want it to be light, like it feels like you just put something on it, then you don't really have to go crazy about it. Yes. So this is how it looks, guys. It's normal spread. And cover it with the other one. But right, then... Let's, let's take our cup with us. And there's the machine. So this is a machine guys, coffee machine. So it has a water container there on the side. Okay. And then what I do is, I put this one. Okay, I'll prepare the cup first there. There. And put this on top. Make sure it's positioned well. And then cover it. there once it's covered then just press this one and it's gonna start like that and this is an Americano so most likely um, it's gonna have more liquid and I don't want it to be that liquidy so if I reach the like a specific level of water on this cup then I like stop it which I'm gonna show you guys so let's enjoy it's brewing now There, so we're done guys, so give it a good stir. So, this is ready guys. I'll give you a nice view of our garden. There you go. So, let's try it. Let's try our milk or our coffee. All right, so I'm planning to have my breakfast outside, guys. So, let's go. Let's go outside, guys. With our coffee. Oh. Sorry. So here's the view outside. Let's have coffee here. There. Can you guys see me? That's a nice spot. <laughs> All right, yeah, there you go. Let's just stay here for a little bit. It's peaceful and quiet. Fresh air. Anyway, guys camera is giving me a battery warning so this might go off so we're gonna continue upstairs all right have yourself some breakfast and I'll catch you later <laughs> 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 Let me get this one. Oh, 
coffee. This is what you get when you are on holiday or on leave and your neighbors are working. Nobody's home. <laughs> I'm gonna get in pretty soon because it's cold. <laughs> So this is my life here in England, guys. Not having so much Filipino friends like I used to have in Dubai. But so far, so good. There are many things that you will be thankful for when you live here. Because it's a developed country. And there's so many benefits, I would say. First of all, I know I've been complaining about the weather, but I prefer it rather than 40 degrees for like six months. All right. Yeah, so the battery's gonna die now, so I'll catch you in a little bit, guys. <laughs> right, guys, so I am done with my sandwich I'm still having my coffee but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go inside because I'm planning to cook lunch I'm planning to cook beef with broccoli or beef with mushroom whatever I have there in the fridge and then I'm gonna clean my room maybe burn some papers and boxes because here in England guys people likes to I would say burn their boxes and papers instead of throwing them uh, if they have a garden and we do have that facility here so I enjoy burning papers guys so let's give that a go in a little bit so keep watching I'm gonna go upstairs and charge my camera battery so keep watching guys thank you two hours later Alright guys, so I just finished my lunch, so I cooked stir-fried beef with vegetables, Asian version because there's sesame oil on it. I'm gonna be uploading that video, uh, me cooking, preparing my lunch, so if you want, guys want to check that out, then uh, go to my profile and click my videos and then you should be able to see that there. So since... <clears throat> You guys are already here. I want to take this opportunity to thank uh, some of my subscribers. I want to give a shout out to Sultan Qadir. Um, thank you very much for your comment and uh, for watching my videos. To Ethel Gay de Posoy. She said, keep safe. Obviously, you felt cold while you are walking. Nice park. Yes, indeed, it was a nice park, and yes, I felt cold last night heading home from my lunch. Uh, sorry, dinner. So thank you very much for your comment and for watching my video again. Ethel Gay de Pozoy, huge shout out to you. More power and thanks for your support. Uh, Muhammad Mansur Muhammad, um, he is my uh, how do I say that? A friend uh, in Dubai. He's from Bangladesh. Um, shout out to you Mansoor my friend um, so next we have Paula Claudio 
she's my ex-colleague in the Philippines but she's now in New Zealand I think or in Australia I'm not sure but um, she was complimenting, complimenting the uh, dinner that I had last night which is a Kurdish food yeah that was really good thanks Pao thanks for watching and for commenting and for your support um, Nisha Audit Nisha Jasmundo I miss you so much she's a really good friend of mine from the Philippines from Davao we have Carla Fresco shout out to you she said yes please keep uploading Inaabangan namin ng hobby ko ang mga vlogs mo po. Thank you very much for subscribing and for keeping in touch, I would say. Thanks for your support. Uh, next, we have Pinoy G at UK. So most likely, he's a Filipino living in the UK. Thank you very much, Kabayan, for your support and for watching my videos. Oh, who else we have here? Um, how do we classify the comments every video um, who else here Martin Connolly uh, he commented on one of my videos about uh, my fifth month in England he said some of the street beggars are professional beggar beggars who are driving nice cars and living in nice houses so he was trying to uh, enlighten me on how to deal with the beggars which I mentioned in this vlog I think if I remember so shout out to you Martin thank you very much for supporting uh, to Zaman Esani he said well explained man thank you very much um, Ifa Timami uh, Marianne Evans shout out to you she said glad that you are enjoying life in the UK welcome mate and keep smiling thank you Marianne uh, said half sisters become one. She's uh, my neighbor before, and I and I grew up with her. Uh, and O, oh, shout out to you, Carla Fresco again. Shout out to you, huge shout out. Thanks for the support. Emper uh, Adra, Camille Ajibon, Trisha Robbins. She said, your accent is fine, you don't need to change it. Thank you. Uh, Pinoy Gia UK, Wendell Marcelino, Jesse Kamalao, uh, Gerald Sai Kai or Sai K, Klingy King, Supremo 75, Hussein Shehada, Alex Papuaya, um, R and C T V Gaming, shout out to you, Fatma Hassan. Thank you very much for all your comments, guys. Jason Balingan, my biggest supporter. Uh, Flourish by Flora. Right, guys. So I have some more here. I I can't really enumerate juries. Uh, Nelia, yeah, I have loads of comment here. Lee Win, yes. So, thank you very much, guys. I think it's time to go now. So, thank you very much for watching my video and for supporting me and for um, reacting to my videos, guys. I really appreciate that from from the bottom of my heart. This is the best time for me to vlog because I'm on leave. However, I'm gonna try my best to. Uh, give you guys a glimpse of how I survive here and how I live my life here in the UK So thank you very much. If you are in the UK, let me know if you have any questions Please give a comment down below share this video to your friend and I will catch you on my next upload. Thank you very much. Bye